it's late October. It's it's you know we've got five days until Halloween, and if I if I remember correctly, let me uh, let me consult my notes here. You 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 are a fan of of Halloween spooky season. Five, five days till Halloween. Is that what five I'm, days? Five Jeff. days. Yes. Jeff. Yes. Jeff. What? It has already started. Oh, Halloween has already begun. Oh my goodness, Michael five Myers days. is right behind you. <laughs> Well, <laughs> behind me, I, I'm spreading his message. I'm, uh, uh, I don't even want to get into the new movie. People are just going to get mad. People well, are just going to get mad. Well, I don't want to make anybody mad. Let's not do that because we got all kinds of horror games for the asylum. Uh, welcome back, everybody. I'm Jeff. I'm Jason. I'm so fucking excited right now. <laughs> yes, but this year, the Asylum has a sponsor. It's not Taco Bell, even though it really should be, but uh, no, it's actually Jason Murphy's brand new D&D live stream podcast video empire taking over the world. Uh, roll fast, dice hard. Jason, this video is going up on Thursday. Uh, that is the day that your live stream happens. Am I right? Oh, hell yeah. Come Come hang out with us. We are at uh, we are available on twitch.tv slash the strangerous. And also we stream on the strangerous YouTube channel, which if you were following me on YouTube, I just renamed my YouTube channel. Okay. Uh, so it streams live there and I try to edit it down. And uh, if you can't make it on 9 p.m. Central, just join us right there uh, and check it out to, on YouTube. I try to get it posted within the next couple of days. Right now, I've got four episodes posted. The fifth should be up pretty soon, but you are going to be joining in uh, on the sixth episode, and it's very episodic tonight. If you're listening to this uh, as it's posted tonight on Thursday, we are encountering uh, the Carnival of the Moon. So this is our Halloween episode. Excellent. So check it out. Excellent, excellent. And we, okay, but so you're doing the, the Carnival of the Moon. We are playing Cultic, which is yes. uh, a game. Uh, we're doing all indie horror this time around. This is uh, being published by 3D Realms. Like, who knew that they were still a thing? <laughs> <laughs> really? Yeah, but this is like, um, from all I could see, this is like blood. Uh, this is like a, uh, like an homage to Blood, where yeah. you got like cults and, and ultra violence and pixel graphics and Jason Smith. We got another another Jason here. Um, but yeah, I, I was looking at this and I was like, where the hell did this come from? I saw the trailer like a few weeks back and I was like, okay, ooh, violence. Oh, I'm into it. Surge yeah, I know. I've been reading about this one. People have asked me. If I have played it, and you know, is, is that a mode on Call of Duty? No, <laughs> then I haven't played it because uh, I'm still I'm still in its throes, man. I thought I escaped Warzone, but this this the Asylum is what can pull me out of it. Yeah, it's, it's like I've been feeling the call to play some spooky games, man. <laughs> and uh, oh, you you and you know, I told you I was like Jeff. I'm into lo-fi. Mm -hmm. I'm into these lo-fi indie horror games. Oh yeah. And Jeff, you made my dreams come true. Oh, dude, I got I got a whole I got a whole week worth of of lo-fi indie shit this year because we've done everything. The, Rage like ten years old. We've played every fucking Silent Hill <laughs> there is. Is it ten years old? It, well, it'll be ten years old next year. So we're like nine and a half right now. But oh. like a little kid, I'm just like it's close enough. I'm ten. Yeah, um, yeah, and, and you know, uh, all the listeners, it, it's like, I would say that you could just oh. start repeating stuff, but all of the listeners and viewers, mm -hmm. they've been there, so they know. They're like, no, you guys did this. Yep. You guys did this already, so they'd call us out on it. So wait a minute, what happened? We're just, we're in like a pile of bodies? Is this like, are we the, 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 are we a starry? Is starry? Whatever the hell they're called? Did we land in the, did we fall down from Earth and land in a, Meteorite crater? Oh, like the bodies? The Diablo guys? Yeah, I have no idea. Ooh, is that a hatchet? It's a trick. Get an axe. Okay. Hell yeah. I like where this is going. <laughs> Me too. <laughs> Man, I was just thinking the other day, it was like, when have we had... Because uh, uh, remember, blood was just, it was ridiculous. It was like the horror version of Duke Nukem. Yeah. It was just, it was all in the age of excess with just Ooh. Gibbs and... Or Gibbs? Gibbs? Gibbs. Man, what the... Hell is going on here? There's uh, just like tons of dead people. Okay. I don't know, but I can safely say that it is that kind of party, and we do need to find the mashed potatoes. <laughs> wait, can I go? Can I go in here? Oh wait, that's 
Oh, oh, oh. I'm oh, gonna, this. I'm gonna sneak up on. Oh, nice. You got an Assassin's Creed. This son of a. Is he? Is that his face or? <laughs> which which way are his feet fa- feet facing? Ooh, just yeah. Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> oh no, that was Jesus. Oh, Jason, I accidentally killed Axe Jesus on his birthday. <laughs> you killed Axe Jesus? Yeah. What is? A lot has happened in the last couple of moments. Is this? We just killed our Lord and Savior. Yeah. What is? Uh, oh wait, no, that's Dongocles. So never mind. What? What is that? A potion? I have absolutely. I feel like you should pick that up. Yeah, I have no idea. Oh look, they've got. Oh, hey, there we go. Oh shit! Is that a shotgun? Uh, ah! Axe Jesus' brother! Axe Weezus, he's back! Oh, Weezus! <laughs> ah, get away from me, Axe Weezus! I don't want any! Axe Weezus! You can get out of here! The brother of Jesus, Axe Weezus! <laughs> we actually established uh, a long time ago, Jason, that uh, Diocles does have his once true uh, son, sent his only son, Jesus, to teach oh, that's us all right. about. That's right! So, wait, what is. Of course! Is this. Is this like a. I don't, I, don't, know. I don't know. Are you? Says. I don't know. I mean, the only I see a typewriter in a video game. I think. Well, we better go save the game. Yeah. Uh, okay. All right. Nice. Handguns. Ammo. Wait. Do, oh. Okay. There's like Cultic, a, you are treating me right so far, my friend. I think this is health. Cause we got. Yeah, but you're at a hundred. Yeah. So. Oh shit. Is this like? Uh, is this is this is like a jail cell for hobos? They make them try to feel at home. They just put a burning, uh, a burning can inside there. So we didn't skip an opening cinematic or anything, did we? Oh, no, there was an opening cinematic. We were kind of talking over it, but it was talking about how, like, people were missing. Oh, it and, was. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, that was, God, that was like seven minutes ago. Yeah. <laughs> um, I'm sorry. <laughs> I, I'm just like, yeah, whatever. You're too excited, Jason. You got to calm down. <laughs> I know. I don't care what the story is. I'm just like, cult guys with axes. <laughs> Jesus. Bro. Lo-fi graphics. Oh, this is beautiful. <laughs> This is beautiful. Okay. Something is blocking the door. What? Found a hat. Oh. How many? Can I throw the hatchets? Oh, shit. I can throw the hatchets. <laughs> yeah. Oh, 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 crap. Okay. It's like a hipster birthday party in here. I'm just, I'm just like, uh, what's the story? Who cares? Play some Slayer. Cultists. <laughs> There's cultists. <laughs> yeah. You yeah well, cult, cult-ick. Yeah. Oh, whoa. It's, well, who's this guy? Oh, shit. This, oh, is that like cult-ish? This guy's got magic, Jason. Oh wait, yeah, yeah. No, he's just having a gun. Oh, okay. Oh, is he shooting with it? Shooting us with a gun? <laughs> what are the eyeballs? Oh my God, can I get his eyeballs? You can grab the eyeballs. I can get his eyeballs. Can what did that do? I can just throw them at people, I guess. You threw <laughs> eyeballs at people. <laughs> okay. Game of I the was ear. gonna say. Game of the year. <laughs> I, this, that's what I was gonna say. <laughs> Fuck I God was of gonna War. Say, fuck God of War. Cult uh, game of the year. Fuck, fuck Far Cry 6. Whoa, whoa. Uh, oh, okay. All right. Oh. oh. Fuck Far Cry 6. Well, I, I just saw... Because, you know, they gave themselves game of the year, right? Oh, they put like, out a game of the year edition as if anybody was thinking that that game was game of the year. They, they put out game of the year edition, even though there was no game of the year awards for it, which that's whatever. Yeah. I know people who have given themselves awards from magazines that don't exist. Not going to say any names. Wait, um, wait, oh, wait hold on. I got a, but, I, I have a, uh, hold on. I have a question. There's, we got dynamite. Uh Oh, and then there's like this wall with cracks in it. Did that ah what boo. oh you defied video game logic yeah jeff and i know how this works why did you do that never mind i take back my game of the year thing no exploding walls <laughs> <laughs> i mean maybe there is an exploding wall but we did the math and that that math was correct and then it, you're telling us two and two does not equal four wait a minute come on cultic mm, come on mm, was something blocking the door here okay never mind i'm not gonna can i just wait can i just like I only have one more dynamite, but try it. Uh, Wait, something blew up in there. No, did you just blow up the shitter? I think I did. I think you I blew did. Up the shitter. It's all right. It wasn't. It wasn't. Okay. You know. Okay. 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 We Explore didn't thoroughly it. and keep an eye out for secrets. All right. Sure. So this, yeah. So this is just straight up blood. Uh, no bones about it. Oh. Remember that crazy long elevator in blood? Ooh. 
No, I really don't remember that much of blood outside of just like cackling maniacally and having the best time in the world. <laughs> that, that is an appropriate memory. <laughs> just, just hitting dudes with pitchforks. Oh shit! Can I throw a chair at people? Oh, oh! I need to find somebody to throw a chair. At. I love throwing chairs. Hell yeah, you do. What does that read? Oh. I can no longer be part of this business venture. I put far too much time and money into the acquisition of this property. The updates it needs to be serviceable. What the fuck is this? All the blood and sweat for leadership to just sell out and run off with the money. This is not. This seems like a very, uh, <laughs> a, a very serious. This seems like it came from a different game, Jason. I, I know. It's <laughs> like, uh, is this the Stanley parable? Yeah. What? Like when this like... person typed their letter of re resignation. Oh my god! But like when I. When I type, it puts more <laughs> letters at the bottom. Oh, uh, I wish you could specifically, like, type a message. And also, the toilet's really gross. Yes. Type that in there. Yes. It's uh, like, what? suddenly we're reading about TPS reports and, like, oh, man, well, this is actually pretty accurate to my time in the corporate world. <laughs> I'm never going back. Never. Oh, shit. Ah. Ah. Throw a chair at this guy. Hold on. Oh, fuck. He chair. sounds. He sounds mad. Oh boy! See, I oh, oh my God! Holy shit! I am Ooh. dying! I am about you to jump die. down in the oh. oh wow! Yeah. yeah, cultists with guns, dude. I was I I was being a little cavalier there. I was being a little uh, a little flippant. Uh, okay, well, that's fine. Just don't throw. I want to see cultic the movie. Yeah, <laughs> I mean, is that just this is mm. honestly? I'm just getting some overly serious Evil Dead vibes, which mm. I'm totally okay with. Mm -hmm. It's kind of... Okay, so there was nothing in there. Why did they even... Wait, if there's uh, nothing... Did you, did, did you ever watch Ash vs. the Evil Dead? I watched like a season of it. Um, and then I... You gotta stick with it, man. I kind of... Well, I, like, I didn't dislike it. I just kind of like... <laughs> You know, Jason, once you've gotten old, older and you've watched a million uh, movies and you've played a million video games, sometimes you watch something, you're like, that was really good. And then you just kind of walk away, like, into the night and forget. I understand. <laughs> yeah. We're like, you don't feel compelled to go back for more, right? Yeah. yeah. Uh, I would like to compel you to go back for more. Would you say, you, are you using some kind of, uh, are you trying to compel me with some kind of, like, call from a deity of some sort? Uh I would like for you to experience oh. Ash Williams mm -hmm. running around a mortuary with his head literally stuck up a corpse's ass. That sounds pretty. That sounds pretty cool. I, I gotta. <laughs> I, gotta I gotta admit, that's a hell of a teaser like, right there. <laughs> they're just like, you know what? Nobody's paying attention. Let's just do. They just like we're just gonna do whatever the fuck we want, and they go bonkers. And there is, in my opinion. Whoa. One of the best fist pumping, fuck yeah for the good guys scenes since Captain America picked up Mjolnir. Oh shit! Okay, in season three. I know that sounds crazy, but huh. fuck yeah, stick with it. What crazy weapon upgrades? Yeah, what? This is like a whole like upgrade system here. I don't have enough parts to do any of these things, but like, yeah. That is nuts. Cultic. Yeah. I think Cultic might be trying to <laughs> form some sort of sexual bond between <laughs> us and it. And it's working, quite frankly. Ooh. It's like, oh, let's throw some stuff in here for Jeff, too. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Let's, let's throw Jeff a scrap or two. Wait, ooh, what's in here? Is there... Oh, the store's opened elsewhere. Okay, I don't care about that. What's over here? And, and you know what's funny is that... Oh. Ooh. Oh, my God. Like... At one point in my life, I would have scoffed. Uh. Oh shit! At at Edge Lord Marilyn Manson stupidity. Uh huh. And now I'm just like, yes, more, more. <laughs> Give me some of that. Give it to me. Give it to me. Mm -hmm. Fucking ooh, take that, Weezus. Yeah. Oh shit! Can I grab his head? Oh, I can't grab his head. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> Woo! Oops. <laughs> I also like how plentiful they are with both ammo and pickups. Like, wait, ooh, I just, I'm unclear. The only thing I'm unclear about, Jason, is who we are and why these cultists have such a mad on to murder us because, I mean, oh, maybe we were that guy that put in his resignation and then they like, the boss <laughs> hated it, they killed us and threw us in a ditch and then we're like, oh, I'll show you. See, That's I right. You're not wearing your flair. Uh, this is my personal journey. If you find something like this, Caitlin's folks think she's run off. 
blah, blah, blah. It has to be Satanists. This is where I hear's chanting come from the meeting room. It's a long shot, but the timing does fit. I'm going to go see if I can get an invite to one of these meetings. Oh, this is like a private investigator. Oh, shit. Ow, fuck. Oh. Well, that was on me. <laughs> I was, I was about to say. That was the fuck did you think was gonna happen? I, I don't know. I'm kind of in a I'm kind of in a murder spree right now. Like you know, that's fair. That's fair. Throwing I barrels gotcha. and eyeballs and heads and berserker rage. Yeah. Oh shit. There I'm was cool with it, man. Dynamite back there, but it didn't blow up. Uh, yeah. I'm mostly just trying to figure out why we're in like a truck depot. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's, this really kind of goes against where I would normally expect to find a and cult. Like, is does nobody own a power washer? <laughs> like nobody here. <laughs> yeah, what do they? Uh, it feels like very Fallouty, right? Like it does. Uh, okay, so now we're just now we're just back here. The armory. Mm. Mm. Okay, fine. Um, I, I mean. There's a lot of tetanus, like a whole bunch of... Not... I've been watching the Saw movies, Jeff. The Saw movies? Yes, I've never... I saw, like, the first two, like, mm -hmm. when they came out. Mm -hmm. And then I've got Peacock, and I'm like... I got Peacock for, like, a month so I could watch Black Phone and Halloween Ends. Mm -hmm. uh, I thought both of them were good. Mm -hmm. uh, and I was like, you know what? Maybe I'm just going to binge the... Uh, I'm just going to binge the Saw movies while I work on Roll Fast, Ice Hard and other projects and other strangerous things. Mm -hmm. uh, and holy cats. <laughs> um, <laughs> uh, they're breaking me, man. The Okay, so the thing for me with the Saw movies is that they killed off uh, 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 Jonathan Saw or whatever his name is, like that was, the, yep, John, Johnny Saw. Yeah, Johnny, Johnny Saw. Saw. They killed him off too early, and then they, and but they kept making the movie, so it had to be like, and in this one, he planned forward seven years in advance and predicted what every single person in the entire world would do, and set up the world's even crazier um, uh, yes. death trap. And it's like, guys, just get a new jigsaw. It doesn't have to be Tobit Bell or whatever that guy's name is, like. Um, yeah. Just put somebody else behind the clown mask. And not the girl. Not the girl with the... the oh, oh, yeah. Amanda. Amanda. And, she and, Yeah. And nothing against and, her. It's just like she was okay for a minute, but the movie just keeps getting into larger and larger leaps of logic about how smart people are. And I'm like... Oh, my God. <laughs> it's like, dude, Johnny Saw, yeah. he is not just a genius supervillain. He's, he's the fucking Batman. Yeah. It's like, with prep time, who would win? Batman or Jigsaw? It's like, Jigsaw can see into the future, okay? Yeah. Yep. But apparently, like, I, I'm on, I keep having to check. I'm like, which one am I on? <laughs> it's six? Am I on five or six? I don't even know. Yeah. And it's like, around, like, part four, it starts getting so labyrinthine. Oh, my God. I oh. feel like. Oh, my God. Fuck, fuck, fuck. Oh. Oh, hit it. It's like. Ooh, it goes. Yeah. Oh, oh boy. Like it goes into Pepe Sylvia territory. Yes. Yeah. Um, yeah. Because I like. I thought the first one. Was, and I don't hate it. Was, I'm just was uh, fine. It's, it's, yeah. I don't hate it. I don't. I, honestly, I'm like, some of these are kind of fascinating. Even the the later ones. But I, it it's a lot. You're asking a lot from me. Oh, holy shit! Do we just get? It's like. Do we just do what I think we did? Oh. Okay. Oh, that's a lot easier way. But if I'm not mistaken, Jason, I think we just got. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, we did. <laughs> because because this game cares about us, yep. I think. Yep. This game gets me. Where it you, does. Where have you been on my life game? Oh, look at the way that they like they, they made the, yeah. the the lighter light up the little pixels uh, on the tree. And there's little, yeah, there's little like runes on the tree, like sigils or letters or something, or is that blood? It's just, oh, that's just, that's just pixels. pixels. Yeah. That's just pixels. Okay. Uh, wait, hold on. Ooh, what's going on here? Ooh. Oh, no. They got that poor man over a... Like a well? Okay, well. Well, oh no! Uh, uh, eat that! Yeah! Hey! <laughs> there you go. Nice. Man, they get me. <laughs> it's just like. <laughs> I, was, oh. I was about to ask I feel <laughs> really. I feel really loved and seen right now. I mean, look at this poor bastard. Yeah. Right? That looks like a bad time. Oh. And But they did it for us. Yeah. Yeah. 
I just want to call Allison and be like, hey, come over here and look at this. <laughs> Somebody made a game for me and Jeff. <laughs> maybe I'm dragging you. Maybe I, I feel like I'm pulling you into my enthusiasm a little much, and you're you're just you're just like oh, shit. humoring me a little bit, Jeff, and that's okay. Man, that's nah. okay. I really appreciate it. I, I, but, I, uh, I oh, shit. What the fuck? Oh. Um, I like a good horror game, and I especially like... Okay, so I... Je uh, I Allison, Jeff just... Jeff, Jeff cut off this guy's head, and then we got to throw it at somebody. Uh, here's an eyeball. Look at this eyeball. Ooh. She just <laughs> nodded and walked away. I don't think she's as impressed either. She, uh, he just picked up eyeballs that are... She uh, she's gone now. She left the room. Okay. Uh, uh, yeah, I no, know. I, uh, I, know. Uh, I, I wanted to say, I mean, like, I, the thing is that I don't really like, like... I'm not really the biggest fan of being scared uh, a lot, but I do like horror iconography. So like this is <laughs> is right up my alley because it's like there are no there are no slender men to jump in front of the camera and go blah 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 blah. It's just like here's a bunch of cultists, here's an axe. <laughs> Get, go to work. <laughs> so this is much more my speed. I don't know. There was a when I was looking at stuff to play this year, there was one that looked like it had a lot of like jump scares in it, and I was like, eh, I don't care what Markiplier plays. We're just gonna do our own thing over here. <laughs> I, uh, uh, some some folks hit me up and asked me what I thought of the uh, all the Silent Hill news that mm -hmm. came out. Yeah, and uh, I wanted to talk to you a little bit about that. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, I knew you were up to speed. I wanted to get your take on it. We don't have to get too deeply into it. But they said uh, everyone was like, you know what? My heart is still broken. It will never be Kojima Guillermo, Guillermo del Toro from. Yeah, every from... everybody forgets the third name, though, in that. Um, everybody, like, uh, everybody in my mind, they always forget that the greatest tragedy I mean, I wanted Hideo Kojima. I wanted Guillermo del Toro, but monster designed by Junji Ito. Oh, oh. that's right, right, right. I forgot about that. It's Fucking like hot damn. It was it, it was brilliant. Yeah. It was such. It was just bliss. It was it was so many perfect things coming together, and I still maintain. So it's like, man, y'all know how much I consume horror, right? It's like Ooh. movies. Ooh. You know, I, I I don't play as many horror games as I should, Ooh. but when I do, I it's it's like a, I I love it. I love it. Uh, love horror novels. Write horror movies and novels, and all of my RPG games they just accidentally turn into horror. I don't even try. It just kind of happens. Yeah. And I'm like, sorry, I'm sorry, it turned into a body horror thing in this in this high fantasy adventure. That's just what I do. Sorry, <laughs> but. It's infectious. I can't get horror away from me, and so I'm 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 kind of jaded mm -hmm. to its effects and everything. But I was remembering, and I was recounting to someone the other day that I had to turn PT off. <laughs> I had to take a break because it it got me. It got me by the short and curlies. Yep. In the middle of the day, I had to turn it off. And so it's like, that is just, and I still remember that feeling. And I rarely, rarely ever get that from any sort of media. Games, movies, books, whatever. It got me by the short and curlies, Jeff. So I, so for the, the Silent Hill news, like I, I'm, I'm of two minds because I'm really interested in the, in the Silent Hill Townfall that's being made by No Code, the guys yes. that made, yes. uh, 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 stories Untold and Observation, because I like both those games quite a bit. Um, I'm a little cynical about the Wait, idea. Wait, was that F or was that Townfall? That was Townfall. F was the Japanese one. Was the, oh, you're right. Uh, you're right. I'm sorry. Yeah. Uh, the thing that's got me that's got me a little jaded is I'm like, look, guys, I love Silent Hill 2 as much as the next person, but I've already played it. I've already beaten it. And so look, we're, we're going to remake Silent Hill 2. We're going to make a movie version of Silent Hill 2. I'm just like, guys, can we get past well, Silent yeah. Hill 2? But, but, but I also realize that there are a bunch of younger people in the world who are never going to go back and play a PS2 game who will get to experience Silent Hill 2 for the first time if Bloober Team does it right. Uh, and a bunch of people, that's, that's cool. horror movie fans that would never play a video game that may get to watch a, a good Silent Hill movie instead of the, yeah. those other two. <laughs> ah. um, but, yeah. Eh. Uh, as far as Silent Hill F goes, I, I, I have really weirdly mixed feelings about that because part of my love for Silent Hill is the fact that it is this kind of weird Americana through the lens of Japanese horror and so putting it like in Japan as opposed to in 
Centralia Silent Hill is to me a, a very strange decision. I'm not necessarily going to say that I think it's bad right off the bat, but it comes off as very strange to me because um, si like, I consider Silent Hill to be like a place, like a specific place that has this kind of evil, not necessarily like something that you would find anywhere but Silent Hill. So, right. Yeah. Um, but yeah, I, uh, I, all I really care about, Jason, is whether it's good or not. I really don't give a shit. Absolutely. Like, I mean, <laughs> but you, what, what you have to think about is that right now, okay, so you remember, oh shit, you I'm know, shotgun. like several years ago when it was like everything was a remake. Yeah. Like everything. Mm -hmm. Everything was getting remade and we couldn't get away from it. Um, and, and that's with uh, movies, right? Mm -hmm. Well, now, now we're experiencing that with games. Right. We've got, OK, now we're going to release it with these better graphics. And now the, we're, we're going to remake it. it it's Ow. it's happening all the time. And after a while that it's it's a fad. So the remake of Silent Hill 2, all of these Resident Evil remakes, Last of Us, etc. Uh, you know, every you know, we're getting a new version of Skyrim on every possible platform oh, oh, forever. It's like, I think that's going to go away, too. So just it's a trend. Wait it out. We'll be okay. Yeah. I mean, the other thing that I keep remembering, right, that um, uh, er, <laughs> this gets really existential, uh, <laughs> is that, uh, Jason, uh, like it or not, and, and viewer, like it or not, like, uh, you and I are no longer the demographic for popular culture. Like, um, if you can repackage Silent Hill 2 and sell it for 70 bucks to a 20 year old who has never, who doesn't know shit about Silent Hill, then that's, uh, that's better than trying to figure out a way to punch through uh, 25 years of horror video game slash movie cynicism to try to impress 40-year-olds on the internet who are probably just going to go on Twitter and call you a piece of shit anyway. So. <laughs> <laughs> well, you know, I, I, I'm actually like the remake of Silent Hill 2. Yeah. I'm down. Yeah. I'm down. Yeah. Ooh. Yeah, totally. Is, I'll, uh, anything? No. I'm, I'm probably going to pick oh, it up holy. because Fuck. it's like, oh, oh Something I love, but it looks really, really pretty now. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. Yeah. Yeah. Um, yeah. Uh, so I don't know. All that stuff is is fine. I also just, I, I, I'm just so tired of being mad at things that happen on the internet. <laughs> <laughs> like, yeah. Why don't they make the thing that I want them to do? And it's like, because they know that you're going to pirate it or write it off your taxes or wait until it's on sale and you're not going to buy it day one for full price. Like, um, the, the, you yeah. know, Fortnite makes so much goddamn money. Why would they ever make more Silent Hill games that are going to sell like, okay. Um, oh, absolutely. But I absolutely. I, I do like the fact that, that um, uh, uh, Konami is actually letting somebody use one of their properties because this might mean that someday I might get to play another Castlevania game as opposed oh. to just taking one of the most iconic franchises of all time and just like locking it up in the basement yeah. so you can run health clubs and shit. Oh, but, yeah. That, no, that is exactly what I was thinking. I was like, yay, all this good Silent Hill news. Now do uh, Castlevania. Yeah. Now do Castlevania. Yeah. Okay, well, it's like God. So, what would what would ooh. what would you do with a new Castlevania? What would you do, Jeff? Oh, two D side scroller. Fuck yeah, man! There's been so many. There are so many indie devs. There's so many like. I would give it to somebody like. Um, I mean, there are so many good Metroidvania uh, clones out there these days that uh, have kind of pushed the whole thing forward. Um, you could probably give it to somebody like the. You could even maybe give it to somebody like the Dead Cells guys or like the. Um, Rogue Legacy guys, or just any one of the uh, like hundreds of Steam devs that have made like really good Metroidvania style games over the years, um, and they would probably oh shit ah I got <laughs> dynamite back at me and then I hit it like a dumb dumb um, ah ah oh my god <laughs> what was that for <laughs> it could be into slow motion for just like yeah wasn't that cool check this out <laughs> I'm I'm. I'm not gonna. Look like, I'm not gonna lift a look a gift corpse in the mouth. Uh, ah, ah. Um, oh no! Oh, 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 but yeah, oh. I, I, I mean, there's so many things you could do with Castlevania. I'm just glad. Like, I think that silent that having a new Silent Hill game from No Code is like such a signal that somebody over there is like 
is is thinking about like the best way to to do this stuff as opposed to just trying to milk it and cash in into increasingly uh, uh, lower sales. So oh, exactly, but, exactly. Oh my God, there's so many guys down here. The hell, the hell. Ah, ah. Okay. Jason, I so, think we're, we're just about out of time uh, yeah. for Cultic here, but I think uh, I think this has been a great intro. I just <laughs> like it's glorious, glorious. I love this game. Uh, yeah. Uh, what uh, where, where, what are the details on uh, getting this? Did you what is this on PC? Steam. Yeah, it's on Steam, Steam? right now. It was like fifteen bucks. Uh, oh, and beautiful. it's only it's only chapter one, so I get the feeling that it's like. They're planning oh, okay. on, on putting out more of it, but you can get it. You can get the soundtrack and all that stuff. Um, uh, but yeah, it's 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 out there. I'm hoping the. I mean, who knows if it does well on PC? It'll probably get on the consoles eventually. Um, but yeah, but I think with that we're gonna wrap it up before I die like a schmo again. Um, let's see, Patreon.com forward slash Rage Select. Uh, this is a very weird year for Halloween, so we're doing. Uh, five uh, traditional five episodes of the asylum starting today and going all the way through Halloween. So Thursday to what? Is, Halloween's on like a Monday this year or it's something. A Monday, lame yeah. like that. Boo. Yeah, talk about you that. Um, so yeah, join us here all through the weekend and for more asylums. Uh, Jason and I are going to be doing all of these this year. I got I got Jason to agree to five of these motherfuckers. And Damn right. <laughs> this is the first one. We got a lot more left to go. Um, and then, Jason, remind the fine folks where they can find you uh, when you're not here helping me decapitate the cultists. Ooh, Ooh. I am all over the place. Twitch.tv forward slash The Strangerous uh, on there once a week with Roll Fast Dice Hard. Uh, you can find me on Instagram. I'm posting all sorts of interesting things at Captain Murphy. Mm. Uh, and also sign up for my newsletter, uh, thestrangerous.substack.com. Wow. So many places. So many There's, places. I, I've, I've been real busy, man. <laughs> Look at Jason all over the internet. Go follow him. Go do all that stuff. I mean, don't follow me. I don't do anything on Twitter. I'm just like a, bla a black hole. Nobody ever gets anything from my Twitter account. Um, and then, yeah, join us back here tomorrow for part two of the Asylum. <laughs>